I think it's time to wrap up Cold as Ice. It's a custom campaign, fairly new one, created in late 2020, a few months back, I believe. Um, anyway, I'm on the last mission, it seems. Yep, only six missions for this custom campaign. On Thin Ice, the UED is trying to keep Kerrigan from leaving Braxis, hold off their forces long enough to be evacuated. Okay, is this our last time seeing Brady Weller? Well then, I guess this is goodbye. I hope that you'll come back to visit again soon. Ha ha ha, sorry to disappoint, but I don't make travel expenses for pleasantry visits. But he, he saved you, girl? Kind of. Oh, I see. Can I ask you a question, Kerrigan? Why do you have to live your life like this? You're not like those other aliens. Surely you can turn over a new leaf. Oh, don't worry, Doctor. I will in Legacy of the Void. No, I can't, Brady. My destiny lies with the swarm. This is my true form. I am bound to the Zerg just as they are bound to me. I am no different than a monster myself. I mean, she did call herself a queen bitch of the universe. It's canon, guys. But you're not, Kerrigan. I've seen the good in you. And once you've brought... you, Once you've bring that good out, I'm sure that everyone else will see it too. Won't you think about it? I'll think about it in the sequel. Hmm. Huh. So it means that much to you now, does it? Ah, <sighs> very well, Rady. If it makes you feel better, I promise that I will consider rethinking my strategy of attack. Sarah, but have our forces ready for me at the rendezvous point. I expect that we shall be departing soon. Yes, rendezvous is a hard word to spell, but a simple Google search can suffice. Oh, that's it, huh? That is that our last time hearing Brady? We'll find out. Gonna miss that little fella. No news of Duran. Oh, is it, is it a cinematic? Oh, there's... Oh, killed him! Brady, no! Wait, what? You miserable Terran insects, you dare send my own minions against me? Well, then we'll see how well you fare when you're faced with the wrath of the swarm. I see how it is. I see how it is. Because I think there wasn't a read me fall, but if I'm understanding this correctly, this campaign is set after the UD uh, successfully captured the Ultimar. So it's no surprise that the UD can retain control of the Zerg here. Uh, for future note, Mapmaker, if you're watching this, and I'm sure you are, um, I would suggest uh, having a read me fall. Just that kind of. Briefly describes your custom campaign, you know, like the premise and the characters, basically, and maybe like a like an installation guide or something, like how to set the game up. Because there are people like new, there are actually newcomers to StarCraft Master, although I'll bet it's kind of rare, but they might have trouble trying to like load up this custom campaign. So it'll be nice if you have some kind of a tutorial on that on the, in the reading file like, like a procedure kind of thing but anyway um what's the objectives again yeah we're we're district so this is the final mission so obviously it's gonna be a full-blown macro and we have kerrigan here same stats i'm sure let's um let's get a macro hatch i got some good amount of middle fields for this one or do I do I want to get overlord speed? Nah, oh, nah, man. This hatchery seems far away from the extractor. I cannot build close enough. This is the close I can get, actually. I'll do that then. You know, you just gotta w work your way around sometimes. You know, if the map maker, if the creator gives you like this base layout, you just gotta work around with it. You know. Or you just, you know, have put like two extra drones, you know, 
into the geyser, into the extractor, and it'll work out the same, you know. Although it's not efficient harvesting, but it'll have to do. And I really appreciate the fact that the man maker keeps using this kind of doodads over here. Kind of tells me that that's where the mission briefing took place or something like this. Like 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 a little outpost. You know? Pretty good. And then we've seen this a few times throughout the campaign too. Like especially I think it was was it was this or that? No, it was this, it was this. My bad guys. It was this. It was this one. So just letting you guys know. Okay, looks like we're up against Brown Terran as well. So two Terrans and one Zergia, I think. But I'm looking forward to the ending of this custom campaign. The only thing I've noticed uh, this campaign suffers from is the lack of um, transmissions towards the end of the... When you finish the mission. Like, it just ends, like, like abruptly, and that's pretty much it. I have some Ursulons. Uh, so I guess our tech option is limited. Unless we can get Hive and Guardians. Well, actually, I'll find out. Yeah, I will find out. We need some evolution chamber here. I'll get two over. I need to find an expand location. This this should be good enough. No, I cannot get a hive, so I cannot get guardians. Mm. Let's see where where we go from here. Okay, then I will. Okay, I got that. Why am I getting this? Should I? Ah, it's okay. I'll get the sight range upgrade. The map layout is similar to the last ones. Map layout. I'm fine with that, to be honest. Okay. So how do I get to that expand location? Yeah, the space is surrounded. I can all I can probably use drops. No, I am forced to use drops, actually. This place is Oh, okay. I might as well fully upgrade my overlords then. Get our Hydra down here, let's get more drones, drones, drones. I guess I'm not gonna get a Spire then. Kirigan yes, took a lot of damage, but it's fine. Okay, that should be good here. Actually, let's um... Get another colony here, just in case. It's pretty quiet now. Calm before the storm. Uh, let's get that. Let's save up some resources here. How's my efficient rating here? I have too many drones, it looks like. No, I. No, the yeah, three drones should be enough here. Okay, I'm gonna get a uh, venture of sacks now. Ever since remastered happened, like you see that hockey V that's highlighted with a with a bracket. It wasn't like that. It used to be like part of the um, description, like transport for Overlord, and it would be color V there under the Overlord description. But ever since Remastered happened, that's not possible anymore because there is a custom hotkey setting in Remastered, which is actually a good thing because you know you can customize your hotkey however you fit, and that will certainly help with uh, like new StarCraft players. I mean, I'm sure it's kind of hard to find new StarCraft players, especially in 2021. But I'm being just, I'm being hopeful here. But custom hockey allows a lot of newcomers to be more flexible with their micro and macro strategies. Like, cause some of the hockeys are pretty archaic. Like O, like like O is like all the way at the right of my um keyboard and whatnot and then there's another horrible one that I forgot like P for example too but then again Z Zerg is okay Hydralisks maybe could have been like A or something but I don't know like in Starcraft 2 I believe um I believe Marines over here in Starcraft 1 the default hockey is M but in Starcraft 2 it's A so that tells you a lot that as RTS uh, got developed more throughout the years, people decided, oh, you know what, we should probably have the unit hotkeys and building hotkeys on the left side of the keyboard because 
you know, that's where our left hand is, you know, most of the time. I'm sure it is. I say most of the time because there are players, there could be players who just play without, I repeat, without, you know, two arms or two hands. There's actually a pro, fun, fun fact, there's actually a pro player um, recently too, like, I, I don't know if you guys know Larba, but he's a third player, he's a Korean StarCraft player, pro player, and funny thing, he, um, oh, uh, it's a double X, man. He actually played with his feet against another pro. That that was like the most BM thing I've seen in a while, man. Like, that was some... The disrespect was outrageous, man. And funny at the same time. I'll, I'll say it was phenomenal. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, that's why I say most of the times when it comes to hockey's on the left side, people... But I guess I kind of went off topic there but the point is the hotkeys tend to be on the left side of the keyboard now ever since you know brood war not brood war expansion like not expansion mac rts yeah that's there you go genre has been developed more throughout the years it's like we're gonna do the mighty expand here it's just fine i'll have a lot of minerals from this Time to get some some units, proper units. I'll get spawn drones too. What is it now? Yeah, this is an island map, so I'm fine with this. The only reason I'm leaving, the only reason I'm leaving uh, some hydras over here is because, like as you can see, orange is pretty aggressive with the mutilus. So that's what. Only two kills there, feels sad man. Okay, that's fine. I actually appreciate the fact that this mini custom campaign doesn't allow the player to tech up to high. Like I don't know, just the fact that I'm limited with the tech tree. I'm I'm okay, I'm okay with that. Oh, come on, that was, that was horrible carrying, come on. Alright, that's, that's enough for auto uh, carry it. Uh, let's get more drones here. Why am I getting attacked? Okay, this guy can go there. Good. I feel like I should prioritize the defense structure here. Uh, actually, let's um, get that macro set up here. I want that energy upgrade on my things for faster um, spawn booing energy. You guys harvest gas for now. I I guess I'll get lurkers again. I need minerals for the time being. Funny thing is, an actual StarCraft matchup, the the Zerg player needs gas more than minerals because of lurkers and because of lurkers and what do you call it? And mutalisks. Yes, that's what I want to say. Um, let's get that melee upgrade. At least, um, Zerg upgrades are pretty cheap. To an extent, I guess. Okay, let's do that. One colony, one sunken. One spore and one sunken, I mean. Might have to build some spore colonies here somewhere. that 
Ah, let's do that there. I think this is fine. In the meantime, I need to keep making units. I have no idea where Zerg could be hiding, to be honest. This gotta be my overlord farm here. I will get Lurker Aspect. I feel like it's so expensive. 200, 200? And one Irradiate kills like Lurk, one Lurker, Defiler, Guardian, Devar. Like, jeez. And you can cast Irradiate three times from a science vessel. You get the plus 50 energy upgrade. Where's the balance in that? Tasagi, man! That's how it works, so. Life ain't fair. I mean, I'm a Terran player, and I have to admit, Terran, the Terran race is really strong. Okay, when. Let's say. Like, there's a, pro, like a number one pro player who plays Protoss, and then that same player plays Terran and then fights itself. As a Protoss, Terran's gonna win, man. I, I guarantee you. It's just, it's kind of hard to be at that point as a Terran player. Protoss needs some buff, to be honest. Like Protoss has like the lowest win rate in a tourney matchup. I mean, because most of the maps in StarCraft One determine balance, race balance. That's what. That's the. That's the actual. The actual true story, man. Yeah, the five lurkers here. I'll get in stair. I I'll get everything, man. I'll, I'll follow that. I don't need these guys here anymore. But maybe I'll just place them here, just just in case. Just in case. I feel unsafe. Okay, it's time to make uh, something falling there. Just because of that vulture. And I think it's time to move also. Yep. Stuck with level 2 upgrades. Get Spire. Did I only really get what, 2 queens? This is sad, man. Okay, let's go attack Brown. What the hell is Kerrigan? She's somewhere. I don't care, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's not... How are you looking? It's okay. My queen's still alive. Yeah, I heard a sea tank. That's why I have this. I didn't get attacked here for some reason. Yes, Lurker is the key to this game. I lost a lot of units there, but I'll take that. Yeah, I have to cancel that. Ah, uh, nice one, nice one. Fun fact! A siege tank without siege mode can actually outrange a lurker. Okay, I need one more cream. Energy's not ready yet. It's fine, I guess. It's time to do a tech, tech change. I'll actually move my hydras down here. Here's what I can do. Hey, get back. Okay, 
Okay, let's keep making the muta farms here. I think I might have to do some drop plays actually. So what I will need to do is get a bunch of overlords and just do the drop play. Okay, they don't have um, they ran out of energy, which is fine. In fact, this gonna, this one's gonna take me a while. Oh, that was not good. The Valkyries don't get attracted by them. That's good. Ah, uh, Kerrigan, you can handle that. How's their upgrade level one? That's shitty. I gotta do a drop play for this one, looks like. Because going over here just decimates my army. Okay, who's loaded in? Okay. This place is fine. Dude, that one's full, that one's full, that one's full. Got more units to fill up here. This place should be fine. Okay, how's upgrades? Let's get that. Cherrigan is fine, to be honest. I'm surprised um, Orange came from that area though. How's energy here? I need 50 on this. Almost done with that. Yeah, I'll wait for the Queen's energy. Come. Yeah, this guy's stuck, but it's fine. If I have enough units, it's my question. Though. Not doesn't seem like it. it. Looks like. So the thing I have to do for this one is like, because Sea Tank just pop my Zerglings with one shot. I need to snipe down with them with my noodles. And it's a good time to save. I made a dent in Brown's defenses a little bit, so... Okay, hotkey 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. And I, th these guys will block it wrong. Get back, get back. Oh my god, I didn't expect them to have um battle cruisers on all units. Okay, this guy has energy. And seven has energy too. I think it should be okay. It's fine. Keep up, keep up the lookout here. Come on, lurkers. Yeah, that, that was actually not too bad. Just need more macro hatch here somewhere. Okay, we got some energies. Why'd I, why'd I have Scourge? Okay, that'll be for the uh, battle group, I guess. Go over here and do a thing. Okay, 
I was really surprised to see uh, Really, I was surprised to see a uh, freaking battle cruiser of all units. Zerglings is in action, man. Got minerals for days here, it's fine. Got another spawn drilling coming here. Oh, what happened? Where's the spawn drilling? Die? I'm glad I got to use my. deploy my, um. Okay. Okay here. Get more mutals here while I can. Very nice. Using all my units here. BAM! I saw that. Oh. This one is surprising. I'm really surprised why it actually distributed. Spy though. Carapace is almost done. All the forces are under attack. I can't believe I lost a lot of overloads from that. Need gas here. I was over here. Live for the swarm! Here, live for them. Because you one shot supply depots and supply depots have a lot of HP man. Not gonna lie. Okay, which one has energy? This guy has energy. You know what? You guys can go back here. Okay, that's fine. Got more mutas here, more zerglings, zerglings. It's unfortunate I cannot land my Command infested command centers there. Actually, it's um. Let me actually land up here. I think orange is like close by, so I will attack orange next. And of course, I'm gonna need to get. Gonna need to bring. A drone here for more expand locations. Did I get level two? No, I didn't. All right, Zerglings, so go check that out. This is what happens when they become when they be an ass. The orange is there. No surprise. I'll take over Brown's base. I like that. Okay, that's good. 
Wow, Orange really has a pathetic face. Hey, you're annoying. Okay, there you go. Okay, just chill, dude. I think I'm ready to attack Orange. Hopefully it's not a... Not an island base. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, let's go. Where the hell are you guys going? Oh, it is a, it is an island base. Damn. Okay, this one's gonna take a while, guys. And I have to re rally my units. I can destroy orange first with mass mutas, which is what I should probably do. Yeah, that's fine. Get gas first. Jesus, I have so many cleans. I have to separately hotkey cleans. Too bad, it's not StarCraft 2. This is why um, playing Brewer is a tall order, to be honest. I feel like I want to bring Kerrigan too. Yo, 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 where are you guys going? Would make my life easier if I had access to um defilers, but it's okay. But overall, I'm I'm digging this campaign, guys. Really, I am. It doesn't feel too bad, seriously. Yeah, I'm going. I'm going to get rid of um. Orange first here. All forces are under attack. Cause that's how things work here. Orange has pathetic amount of base. I think I'm sure the map maker pretty much added like orange like last or something. That's all I can think of. Oh they have level two upgrade, that's pretty bad. Fine. I was droning here. We could drone up more. Get more infestarians if possible. Okay, why don't we just have a puzzle here? They even have David deploy murders. Interesting. Cannot be the swarm, though, unfortunately for them. Expand there, this looks like a good gas. A lot of resources to take. I'm perfectly fine with this uh, bizarre expand here. It works. Okay, I definitely need more overworks. Okay, 
Let's go patrol. Let's see what happens. more units. Shots. All forces are under attack. Okay, Orange is dying, which is fine. Just in time, my gas expand is done. I'm having more gas now for some reason. It's fine here. It's probably safe here. I don't even know if my infested Terrans did their job. But. I'll take it that we good. Oh, that's a dead, dead guy here. Okay, let's go attack. I'll kill you, you nasty girl. Yo, that hurts. Folks are gonna kill me. It's fine. Okay, go kill that for me if you can. I was over here. Yeah, I'm doing good here. I'm getting saturated nicely. Waste of two storms. But... The queen is gone, man. Hmm. What else do I need to make? This definitely fits well for my last mission. Last. I think it's. it's for this custom campaign. I think it feels well. The difficulty is there. Wow, that's not gonna be good. But you still should do the job here. Level 2 upgrade though, that's... That's pretty painful, not gonna lie. Need more hydras. I think I got enough resources. It's time to pump up more macro units. Or units, rather. Should probably build more defenses, but it's okay. 
Not the Overlord? Yes, Can I get him to defend here? Yes. Well, I didn't sell mutals here. I'm, I'm fully upgraded, guys. I, I got all my buildings. I'm fully upgraded. I got all the possible research here. I probably need more queens here just in case. Something tells me. Okay, good, good, good. More attack is in order here. Hey, good, good. My APM increased a little bit. I think this queen deserves the honor to interest the third command center here. Yeah, so for this one, I definitely recommend the player to get some kind of queens to pop some uh, high ground sea tanks. It'll be worthwhile, guys. It'll be worthwhile. So do that if you can. Or if you're not, if you don't want to use a lot of APM for this mission, it is a custom campaign, so it should be it should be doable enough with just mass mass mutilists, even if they have bunch of ant here because in the end the AI is gonna get destroyed so. okay. I'm, I'm glad our uh, chicken got to come uh, join the fray for the final mission. It looks like there's more over there. Oh, I haven't seen a high ground water pallet in a while. No one hardly uses that, you know. Let's go check it out. I knew that we couldn't trust any of of them aliens, this bitch here is crazy just like the UED. So the colony of Brax is now afraid of my power? <laughs> yes, they're right in doing so, for I am Kerrigan, the Queen of Blades. Ahahaha. Ah, my Queen, I have arrived with the swarm and we are ready to resume our course for Tarsonis. Are you alright, my Queen? I'm fine, Duran. Let's go. The sooner we make it back to my hive clusters, the sooner I can begin to plot how to take control over this sector and crush the UED. That's it. I guess the rest of this area here is pretty empty, but hmm. I like that. It was a hard mission, actually. I mean, not hard, but the difficulty was there somewhat, so I'm glad I got to um, play this custom campaign here. Um, I want to actually check out the entire map layout for that one. So, I'm, I'm, I believe there's going to be a cinematic here. I'm, I'm kind of sad that Bra Brad Brady... Yeah, poor guy. Never had a chance. But it's okay. Anyway, I wanna, what I want to do is I want to check out... The map here is empty. Okay, so this is just a way for the map maker to just not use the entirety of his map. The with this kind of layout, there's also a play. You can do a drop play here. You can probably do some kind of drops over here and then come all the way down here and ambush white space. The th three battle cruisers. Though. They had one over here, right? Yeah, like the boss. And orange here stuck in their little small base. Could have used the reverse ramp re in remastered, of course. There's a reverse ramp for remastered, so that would have gone well for this one. But 
Again, I, I was fine with this uh, expand here, like uh, how I had to use two hatcheries just to get gas and minerals. I was fine with that. But overall, I gotta give props to the map maker. I think this one is slightly better than Migration. Yeah. He's the same guy who made Migration the Lost Wars custom campaign. And he has another one in store for me. It's another mini custom campaign that I'm looking forward to play. But I have to wait because my next one's gonna be Champions of Candia. I hope I pronounced that correctly. But anyway, that's it for DK, folks. Thanks for watching, as always, and yeah, stick around for more custom campaign content in StarCraft Remastered. DK signing off, folks.